What's up, y'all? Hey, guys, it's Steph. And Tasha, we are back with another mukbang. If you're new to our... <laughs> you keep doing these accents. If you are new to our <laughs> channel, please check out the rest of our videos. If you like them, then subscribe to us. If you don't like us, then go subscribe to somebody else. <laughs> Um, thank you for being here and checking us out and welcome to our channel if you've been here before welcome back you already know OGV family we love y'all what's up with y'all we chilling we chilling with y'all and today we are gonna let Stephanie explain what we eating today you guys we are doing well I'm doing birria burrito and taco mukbang and Tasha is doing Japanese she got some yeah. salmon fried rice and some marinated tofu. marinated tofu bomb y'all it's really good Whew, I can't wait this, are you ready it came inside of this juice yeah I'm ready Let's get into the video. That's Tasha, that's Steph. Let's go ahead and fill in the rest. We gonna eat a little, prank a little. Our story time is the best. Have you LOL when you click play? No, this ain't no click bait. All right, guys, we are back and ready to dig in. So I have three birria tacos. I think one might be chicken, I'm not sure. Then I got a chicken birria burrito. And then this is a piece of a chicken berry quesadilla we got the consomme, consomme and some kind of sauce mm. i'm gonna go with i have salmon fried rice you guys and i have some marinated tofu but i already told y'all in the beginning so i like the the salmon fried rice from this place it's called takuma but i did doctor it up with a little bit of maggie oyster sauce sesame oil and some tooth some boldock a bulldog. It's not like bulldog. <laughs> yeah, that's him. You know, a little suspicious. You got a bulldog in there? Uh uh. Ooh, y'all. I don't eat those. That's about to be good as heck. Mm. Does anybody use mm. that term still? Bulldogger? Mm. Mm -hmm. That sounds strange. Where did it come so. from? I think if you use it, you might be a little aged. I haven't okay. heard any young people saying that. I want to know who came up with the term bull dagger, though. <laughs> and what is, why? What does it mean? It's, a dagger is a weapon, and a bull is an animal. Mm. There's mm. tofu. Mm. Oh, that's your mom. Is it? Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm happy for you. Look at all this marination at the bottom. Mm-hmm. Mm. Dropped it on my pants. Oh, it's messy. This is good though. Ooh. Remember the first time we tried this, Amira? <laughs> mm. Mm. This is good. I got some poppy taco, y'all. I feel like this tastes better than it did has before. Really? Mm hmm. Mm. Well, mm. I'm happy for you. Let's mm. try out this OG. They call it OG. It's a lot of stuff in this. Y'all, I don't even know what. But I didn't. I took the cheese off. <clears throat> uh uh. Why are you doing enough? Mmm. Mm -mm. It's so good. All right, let's check the chicken out. Okay. Yummy. Mm. Definitely like the the beef better. Okay. It's good though. Huh? No, you shouldn't be eating beef. Mm hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay, wait a minute. This bite over here tastes good. The grilled chicken. Very chicken, good. Mm. This is delicious. It is. Happy for you. <laughs> so. Mm. You said mm. you were gonna talk about what I told you to talk about. Who was it? Well, I forgot you. Um. Oh, shout out to Black China. Oh, Black China. Yeah. Shout out to Black China. She is either she is or already has. I think she's already she already has. has. I watched her. I haven't um mm. seen her though. All my stuff is getting on your beard. You talk about. Have you seen her since she got things done? Like the not for sure. Uh -huh. I saw a picture that said it was afterwards, but you know, people oh. be lying. I don't think she's telling me yet. Mm. But if you've seen her, y'all, send me a picture. So she has gotten her silicone taken out of her butt. Mm -hmm. 
And then I think she had it in her face too. I think she had, she got the fillers removed from her cheeks. Mm -hmm. And right here, her jaw. Right. So she went to make her jaw bigger? I don't know why she did that. Not sure, I guess so. I'm guessing that's what I she guess did. So. Yeah. Maybe it had to go with the cheeks, I don't know. But, sorry, like China said it herself. Y'all here looking like Jigsaw. <laughs> I mean, but if they like it, you know, whatever. I'm just saying, y'all really over here looking like Jigsaw, for real. Some of y'all over here looking like Jigsaw. I'm like, ugh. I think when they go too far with it, yeah. Yeah. I mean, but you do what you do. I wouldn't I wouldn't not be somebody's friend or talk yeah, I mean, crap behind their back. Like Jigsaw, go right you know, here. but I'm just saying. I'm letting y'all know in your face. <laughs> I mean, I guess high cheekbones are a... Thing, you know, mm -hmm. it's just a desirable trait for some people. Do I have high cheekbones? No, nope. so. <laughs> okay. <laughs> or is it when they smile, they want, I don't know. I think Tiana Taylor, if hers is not fake, I think she's like, she has high she, cheekbones. I think so. You just like okay. that look, I don't okay. Know. Um, well, y'all cute, fake cheekbones or not, <laughs> you just look like Jigsaw. Yeah, I, um, you know, there's. I feel like it's trending now to get work done, mm -hmm. and that's fine. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's fine. But I like natural. Mm -hmm. and I feel like a lot of people, even with the makeup, sometimes it's a little bit extreme. And I feel like a lot of people don't realize how beautiful they are without makeup. You know what I mean? Let me tell y'all something from a man's perspective, okay? <laughs> Not a man, but y'all know what I'm saying. From a woman who likes women. Uh, I see some of you. No, nah, it's not everybody. Some of some people look a lot better with makeup. But I see a lot of females that. And I mean young girls. I'm talking about younger ladies. Um, I see a lot of young girls who have on a lot of makeup. Mm -hmm. And then when they take the makeup off. <clears throat> they look 10 years younger. Yes. It seems like makeup yes. ages younger women. I'm not sure why, but I guess we, I don't know, but y'all still cute with the makeup, but I'm saying I've seen a lot of women who look way better without makeup to me. I'd rather see somebody 20 years younger looking, you know what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. All y'all cute though. What's we just, we just talking because we ain't got nothing to talk about. <laughs> and I don't know if Donald Trump is in jail, so we can't talk about that. Right. I'm looking forward to the natural trend coming back though. Mm -hmm. I feel mm -hmm. like a lot of celebrities are starting to do it and it's going to rub off on the rest of society. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a beautiful thing. Y'all going to see. Stephanie was saying that she hopes that, you know, Black China's thing and whoever else is doing it rubs off on the other ladies. And so they know they don't have to go get fillers or go get bbls or because you know it is it, it is trendy nobody cared about it before but once people start doing it celebrities start doing it regular people i guess they look at them and say oh this is the thing and people don't realize there's a lot of impressionable humans mm -hmm. i have a question for y'all hey you at what point in your marriage, do you think the differences are too much? Like, there's things that, okay, let's say if you wanted, we was talking about this earlier, a baby. If you really, really wanted a baby and I really did, was like, nah. Yeah. Do you think we should stay together? No. Or do you think we should? We think we should separate and then you do what you want to do? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I agree. Because if I want a baby. That's a lot. To that's sacrifice. important to me. Right. And you really don't want one. Mm -hmm. It's a lot to, to take care of a baby when you don't want one, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. And it's a lot to ask somebody to be there with you. It doesn't matter. You, when we got together, I didn't have a baby. Now, if you was like, I don't want no nine-year-olds, right. then okay, bye. But, you know. Okay, so what about with the pet situation? Because I think you really, you really do want a pet. Mm -hmm. And I really don't. I didn't know you really didn't. I just know you don't. Um, well, 
I think there needs to be a compromise. Oh, how can you compromise them though? I feel like one person is gonna be compromising. Yeah. <laughs> the other person ain't. Because I mean, how are you gonna compromise? Did you get one or don't? One person has to compromise. Okay. Um, I, I don't know who that person would be, but I feel like everybody should get <coughs> give and take something. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it would have to come down to... Okay, what about if you have the dog, but I never see it? Like, it has to stay in the other room? I can say that that's going to happen, but it's not. I mean, you got to live up to your end of the compromise? That wouldn't be my compromise. What do you think? Oh, okay. About? So, well, you wouldn't... I'm saying you can get the dog, right? But you don't want to compromise that to keep it out of my face. What do you mean you're saying I can get the dog? I'm saying my part of the compromise is, okay, yes, I will... Be okay with the dog being here, but I just don't want to see it. Are you? Asking I'm you? asking you how you would feel. If I said, if you said I had to keep the dog in the room, mm -hmm. no, I'm not keep. Why would I keep it stuck in the room? That's not fair. Oh, it's gonna be stuck in here. It's the same thing. It's just a smaller quarter. It has its own room. So you want? They can run around that whole room. Yeah. Yeah. Well, um. So that means when I spend time with dog, I have to be in the, that right. room. Mm -hmm. So, or outside. You can take him to the dog park. Mm. Well, I don't know. I'm not gonna um, just agree to that, no. I'm not gonna agree to make a dog stay in a room. What's the point in getting a dog? Getting a dog to make it stay inside of a room? Okay, so would you agree to not get one? No, I want one now. Matter of fact, I want it today. Mm. Anyway, um, well, mm, I feel like there's things I want. You don't. I don't think you gonna we go for it. What do you want? Have you said something? Mm. I mean, I wouldn't mind another wife, but a set. But I'm sure you're not open to that. You ain't about to, you're not about to compromise with me on that. So why should I compromise on a dog? All, everybody wants different things in life, you know? You want stud wife? Why you throw stuff? That's another thing. I want a wife that don't throw stuff around all the time. Like you so rough. I'm not rough. You don't say nothing about me being rough other times. So don't say I'm so damn rough. You want it either want it half the time, you either want it all the time or none of the time. <laughs> you can't have both. I'll take gentle. Okay. Yeah, I'll take gentle. All right. So um. You want some Mm-mm. I ate it all anyway. Um, so about you and uh you want a stud wife. Right. Why? Why, babe? Why would you want another wife? I mean, the more the better. If you could have two women, two films, why wouldn't you? Who want said that? I wanted two films? I didn't say you did. I just said why wouldn't you? I mean, I mean, two studs? Just imagine, I'm right here, and y'all, she's here, and I'm here. That shit bomb as hell. Like, when you don't feel like doing nothing, you can take a break for the day, go do whatever you want to do, and I'm here, and I'm being taken care of by our other studsmen. Mm -hmm. Why don't I take a break now, before the studsman gets here? And then while I'm baking, you can find somebody. While you up? While I'm taking my break, you can go find somebody. I mean, that's what I was thinking about anyway, honestly. Cause you, you not want to compromise. You, I don't feel like you doing well for marriage. I don't marriage. feel like what? I mean, you're not com what? compromising. You, you don't comp You don't give. You wanna. You want me to give everything. Me to compromise everything. Like what? Everything. What if I made you? Everything. 
you get my mouth for? Because I wanted to slap it. <laughs> everything, okay, everything you want. I gotta sit here and be like, okay, what do you need me to do now? What today? What do I need to compromise? How do I have to sacrifice myself I feel again? Like I compromise way more than no, you do. No, boo boo, no. And also, anyway, I'm not about you, to argue about this. Okay, if you feel it, then we both feel it then. The whole point is we, obviously, you feel the same way I feel. Okay. You over compromising. I'm over compromising. Good. This shit is not good. This shit ain't. It's not. Oh, you need what to I find. Okay. That's what you need to do. I don't have time for you today. I don't. Anyway. I'm gonna go tomorrow and find my dog. Either. And it's gonna. I've been. In the... Huh? Nothing. This is a resolution. <laughs> So our all of our problems that what? we had. Case number. What is this? What is a marital settlement? What's that's it? for you know when once everything is set once we're separated. These this is the the agreement that we have as far as what goes where and all that. What are you talking about? After what? After we're permanently separated, this is the agreement to determine, you know, where all of our um, assets and things go. Where is so, that? yes, basically, I filed for a divorce. I, I filed for a divorce. And this <laughs> is the marriage settlement agreement. I need you to sign that. Uh, the marital home should be sold. Um, no children are expected. Am I supposed to read all this? Well, I mean, you don't have to. Just sign it. Spouse one shall be entitled to exclusive possession and use of the marital home until sold. So you get to have complete use yeah, of that it's home. It's like I'm the woman. You the man. You got to go find your apartment. Oh. Uh, you know uh, how the lady normally gets the home? Yeah, what? You know how the woman normally gets the home? It's usually the one with the kid. What? Elijah going to stay with me. Retirement. Stephanie gets 95% of stock holding. <laughs> I get 5% of the stocks. Yeah. And you get 95%? Yeah, Why? I mean, I control it 100%, so I'm giving you money going into it. This our money, but I mean, I made so much at this point. I'm giving it back to the account. I'm giving it back to our savings account at this point. Parties get the balance of the joint checking. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> so our savings. Uh, so our savings account, you get 99% and I get 1%? Why don't I get shit? Oh, is that? I meant to put 5% on that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll have that changed. In our I'm checking account, you get 75% and I get 25%. Why are you getting so much more? Hmm? Why do you get so much? I feel like I've compromised more in the relationship, so now you got to compromise with the money. But I mean, you can always have your lawyer look it over and decide if you want to come. I don't have a lawyer. Okay, well, get one. Who's you your don't lawyer? have to get one. Jacoby. Jacoby and Myers? Mm -hmm. Well. Not Myers, but Jacoby is mine. Jacoby? Yeah. Oh, what's homeboy name that I be seeing on the... James. I'm going to call Sweet James. <laughs> Sweet James. I see him up on the... <laughs> I see him on the billboards. I'm calling Sweet James. Sweet James seems like he up to something. Uh, is there anything in the, else in here that I should like? No, I think you should just sign it. Everything is fine. I'll let you double sign it. And we're the respondent right here. Respondent. Monthly expense. Zero. Total net worth zero. So that's my life insurance zero. Oh, you tell you act like I don't have no expenses. Yeah. I mean, you don't. And then you're, you don't have none yet. I mean, after the marriage is on me to Hey, birthday. I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, but why you got expenses? Why do you have monthly expenses? Don't worry about that. I'll get it fixed. <laughs> so that's your net worth. I think they were supposed to put it half and half. Why don't I have any monthly income? Huh? Only you have monthly. I don't have any monthly. Okay. Yeah. Just sign the paper. Okay. I'm sorry. Where do I sign? Money on the back. 
Oh, Yo. <laughs> Here you go. Take your divorce papers. You still ain't trying to sign. I ain't trying to. I ain't signing nothing. Stephanie is out of her mind. Gotta compromise. What do you want me to compromise? You want you want me to let you get a wife? Uh huh? No, let me get the divorce and have all the stuff. You can have a divorce if you want one. Okay. You ain't you ain't getting that. I'm not. Mm -mm. What can I have? Half of everything. All right. But. I'm gonna cause trouble. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna say I should get more because we have a kid. Well, he said with me. First of all, he is not a minor, so they don't care about that. They don't? No. <laughs> He's in college. So? <laughs> He's not a minor. We have to pay for his college. No, we don't. That's not a, a marital bill. But the, the judge will feel bad. And be like, well, you okay, guys well, did guess agree. What? He's staying with me, so you're going to have to give me the money. That's what, it doesn't matter. Okay, fine. You going to take the dog too? No, you haven't. You can have the dog. The dog is all yours. And them squirrels. And the rats. Possums. And oh, whatever man. else you got back there. You can have all them. Stephanie playing with y'all. 100%. <laughs> Stephanie playing with y'all top. <laughs> she know damn well. She don't want to lose all this. <laughs> Okay. You don't want to lose all that, and I don't want to lose all that. But you playing? I ain't going nowhere. Stop playing with me though. Anyway, y'all, I think it was funny. It was fun. It was funny. I like the uh, <laughs> I like the divorce decree. <laughs> I couldn't find the divorce papers. I had to find okay. that. No, and I liked it, it. It was a couple places that I was about to feel something out, but it looked like it was real. It looked mm -hmm. like it was really gonna go through. I was like, I better not play. Right. And then, and they like, oh y'all ain't married, y'all ain't together. Y'all been divorced. Okay. All right, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Check out our vlog channel and our shorts channel. And uh, till next time. Have a good vibe. Peace.